Hi guys, today I'm going to read you a book called Pinkalicious, The Royal Tea Party. Pinkalicious, The Royal Tea Party. Goldilicious is the best unicorn ever. I want everyone to know it. You should throw a party. Peter said. That gave me a great idea. Listen, Goldie, I said. Goldie is her nickname. I'm going to crown you Princess Goldilicious. There was a lot to do to get ready for the coronation. That's Goldilicious. Peter heard. This is Pinkalicious. Pinkalicious's younger brother, Peter. Can I do something? Peter asked. Sorry, Peter, I said. This party was only for members of the royal court. I thought about what Peter does the best. Peter likes to eat. Maybe you could be the royal taster, I said. That means you taste all the food. You make sure it's perfect. Great idea, Peter said. I can't wait to start. I decorated the back. Backyard with Goldie's favorite color, pink. Then I went inside and planned the perfect menu. What do you think, Peter? I asked. Peter had a little sip of tea. This tastes okay, Peter said. It's a little boring, though. Don't be silly, I told him. It's perfect. Soon my guests arrived. Come in, come in! I cried. You are just in time to help get Goldie ready. Can I help? Peter asked. No thanks, I said. But you can go to the kitchen and take the food outside. Peter went to the kitchen. He was in there for a long time. What are you doing in there? I called. The royal, the royal taster is only supposed to have one taste. I'm just making sure the food is perfect, Peter replied. I'm coming outside now. Finally, Goldie was ready. Let the royal tea party begin, I declared. My friends and I sat down. Goldie had the place of honor. I noticed the food looked a little different. I sipped my tea. Pardon me a moment, I said to my guests. Then I dragged Peter away. What did you do to the what did you do to the tea? I whispered. I made it better, Peter said. I used all my favorite foods. I put maple syrup in one teacup. I added peanut butter to another. I stirred strawberry jam and vanilla yogurt. Into the other teacups, Peter continued. As the royal taster, I felt the sandwiches are tasteless, so I made better ones with ice cream instead of mayonnaise and goldfish crackers instead of tuna fish. This is a disaster! I cried. I went back to apologize to my guests. Yum! Molly explained. This sandwich is delicious. My tea tastes yummy too, Lila added. What's your secret, Pinkalicious? I tasted my tea again. It tasted like maple syrup. Hmm, it is good. My friends didn't seem to mind. The food tastes extra special. Maybe this party wasn't a disaster after all. Maybe it was, hmm, a perfect royal tea party. Let the coronation begin, I said. Goldie pranced forward. Goldilicious, you're the smartest, most beautiful unicorn ever. I touched my wand to Goldie's horn. I hereby royally declare you Princess Goldilicious, I said. Hooray! My friends cheered. I gave Peter a new hat. Then I touched my wand to his hat. And I declare you, Sir Petey, the chap, I said. Here, here, said Peter. Who wants more?